Hey guys, I'm SKB and you're watching SKB Plays On and welcome to Assassin's Creed Origins Update 1.40 which actually has the Trial of the Gods right now going on. The Trial of the Gods, uh, Trial of Anubis, Trial of Sekhmet is live right now. It's gonna be there for a uh, whole 7 days uh, up until March 13th. Make sure you get to uh, finish off the Trial of the Gods and if anyone's wondering whether you can get all 3 weapons of the 3 sets uh, during the Trial of the Gods, maybe because there is this one thing where the trial of the gods which we have right now are two in number which means one of them is at normal one of them is at hard mode the normal one gives you the first set items of anubis and then the hard mode gives you the third set items of anubis and also the community challenges are also going on which means if you finish the hundred thousand points which is on pc or any number of points required for a different console definitely maybe you might get the second set items of anubis so i'm guessing if anyone's new they may have a chance of uh, this month giving them all the three sets of anubis so anyways i would like to talk first mainly about the gameplay right now that i'm doing i'm using a spear which gives me the health on kill perk the Sekhmet Spear, I'm using a Sekhmet Spear against the Trial of Sekhmet as you can see and the level of enemies is at 48. This Trial of the Gods is definitely gonna be at hard mode which means all the enemies at 48 is mainly because this level is a suggested level of 48. So yeah, definitely they're gonna be 3 levels higher than you even if you are at level 45. And the best shields for you to use is the ones which have level 3 or level 4 melee resistance. Make sure you use shields which have really high melee resistance because if you get hit by the enemies they are definitely gonna do some damage and high level melee resistant shields are gonna reduce the damage by a certain percent. Right now the one which I'm using is the guardian lion so definitely does a max, max amount of melee resistance which is 50% of the incoming damage is reduced from the minions and also the spear is giving me health back and the health on kill perk rather than the health on hit is good because the health on kill still does 15% healing when you kill an enemy which means you can get more amount of health after you kill an enemy and yeah make sure you do have that shield at high melee resistance because you don't want to get hit by these minions and lose too much health but yeah i'm using the spear mainly because of the long range attack as you can see i'm using the roundabout attack which does multiple enemy hits that definitely makes sure i take out each enemy fast by the by hitting them all at once rather than going at one enemy at a time and also make sure you to use the favorite bows, the morning sun and the neck bed swing. Right now I'm using the neck bed swing as you can see. I just uh, made sure the range hit multiplier on the bow takes out goddess Sekhmet as soon as possible so that I don't have to deal with her fireballs and the laser. And now that I'm done, what you are going to get once you finish this trial of Sekhmet at hard mode is this. The Sword of Duat. Finally, we were supposed to get it in the previous community challenge, but they did not give us. But we finally have it. There you go. And I'll be doing a little bit of a showcasing for the Sword of Duat. And also, if you want to check out some gameplay, do check the description down below. I will put the link for my uh, stream, which I did earlier. Definitely has the Sword of Duat gameplay in it. And. Uh, as you can see the blood red markings make it look that much better and the health on hit and the combo multiplier and also the critical hit rate is pretty amazing for this sword. I would have rather uh, liked the health on kill perk but then this sword would have become even more overpowered than it already is. Maxed, maxed out critical hit rate, maxed out combo multiplier, are you kidding me? And a health on head perk, this sword is definitely pretty awesome. And that's about it for this video. If you want any gameplay, please check out my uh, stream in the description down below for the Sword of Duat gameplay at the end of the stream. 
and if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and thanks for watching and keep smiling and see ya